Hi, my name is Lorraine Gilbert, and I'm the author of 52 Bible Lessons, Bible Introduction for Children, and I just want to thank you for your interest. This is a low-cost school curriculum because we know we believe that learning about God should not be expensive. It's only $34.99, and it covers an entire year, and we go through Genesis all the way through Revelation, 52 lessons, and it's great for home, it's great for a Sunday school class or a church activity. So let me just talk a little bit more about what we're getting into. Um, I have been a teacher and a volunteer Sunday school teacher for many years. I've taught both in Methodist and Baptist churches. And um, a couple years ago, I was given the charge to teach third grade Sunday school. And this was when the ch children had just received their own personal Bible. Um, and what I was asked to do was to teach a little bit of, you know, the introduction to the Bible from Genesis all the way through Revelation in the course of a year. I was given a book that was outdated and out of print, and it only had 12 lessons in it. It was a great foundation, but there wasn't near enough material. So we started looking online and looking everywhere we could, going to already what was printed, to try to find something that I could use to teach a class, but we just really couldn't find anything that of what we were really looking for. So that's why I started writing my own lessons, and I was spending six to eight hours a week writing lessons and getting materials together, and most people just really don't have that kind of time. So I decided there's got to be other people who are struggling with the same thing I am. I might as well put this together in a book so that other people can have access to it. Um, and that's what I've done. This is the third edition. Um, so every year it gets a little bit better. And I'm really excited about what there is to offer. So let's look at the Bible or look at the book and um, see what we learn a little bit more about it. All right. So the first page right here. Um, is about the table of contents and as you can see it has um, room hints and teaching hints and the reason why that that's in there is we know that most people who teach Sunday school or, or church activity or even homeschool are not certified teachers and they are also um, not clergy so this is going to give you some helpful hints to make your class run really smoothly and then you're going to see that there's the 52 lessons there's actually an outline on page um, starting with page 12 that really goes through um, every single book of the Bible and it's a great great quick access alright and then you're also going to see there's some bonus sections because um, just things that might make your teaching a little bit easier and a little bit more fun alright and so this is the very first page of every single lesson and um, this is a new addition to just the this edition this is a new concept for the third edition and what it does is it has a calendar significance so that you're teaching about back to school in August, you're taking, teaching about Easter and Easter, Christmas at Christmas. So we correlate the Chris, Christian calendar, um, the school year, and just the things that are normally happening in a child's life because children learn by what's going on in their life. So you wouldn't want to talk about Easter during Christmas. Um, so it all makes sense, all right? Um, the other thing that we have is a copy and swipe. Now, some of you may not know what a copy and swipe is, so let me explain what that is. This is about a paragraph, and you can copy it and paste it into your email program or text program or um, however you communicate with your parents, and you can send them a weekly message that will help them incorporate their family life with what the students are learning in their class. And these are really simple activities. It may be looking up a verse, or it may be even just taking a walk with your child, or looking at the clouds and you're just taking an activity that you would normally want to do with your kids anyways but this time you're centering it around the lesson that we're talking about that week so they get um, you know more exposure to what um, the lesson is and it's just all coming together for them the next section is supplies now, most of those supplies you're going to be able to find in a normal church closet or in your home, crayons, markers, colored pencils, scissors, glue, tape, things like that. Occasionally, we'll ask for something else, like maybe cotton balls or something like that. But this is going to give you all the supplies that you need, and you can get all of that from a local discount department store. You don't have to purchase anything additional. Um, you, know, you don't have to do another book, which is a craft book or anything like that. All your stuff is going to be able to be easily found. Um, the other thing it's going to offer you is a special snack, and if you are one of those people um, who like to coordinate your snack to the lesson, you're going to have a snack idea for each lesson. It's going to be like a Pinterest-type snack so that 
um, your children are you know, going to really enjoy having the additional exposure um, it, relating to the lesson and what they're eating that day. And then there's a background. Now this is where you get your five minute prep. It gives you a really like a paragraph to read so you'll have an idea of what your lesson's going to be about and you'll have a really just skim this page and you'll really be ready to start teaching your lesson. Okay. And then the last here is plan ahead so that before you, if, especially if you're teaching this at a school or um, a church or something like that, before you leave, you're going to be able to plan ahead and look in your closet and make sure that you have everything that you need for next week. Um, and if you need something special like a poster board or something like that, you're going to be able to get that before, uh, or you'll know before you come back to church on Sunday that you need to pick that up. All right. Now, the other thing I want to show you is this is um, page 26, and this is a, where a lot of this whole curriculum is based off of. Um, we divide the, the books of the Bible into sections, and you know, since this is an introductory, it's broken down as simply as possible. So it's the book of law and the, the books of history, Old Testament history, poetry and prophets, and then the gospels and New Testament history, and then the book of letters. And during this lesson, we just do an overview of that. Um, but then in each of the lessons that we teach afterwards, when we talk about Genesis, we're going to talk about the fact that they're a book of law. And um, it just really helps set up the whole thing so that it makes it easier for the children to really relate to what, how the Bible is set up. And one of the reasons why I wrote this, bi this um, Bible curriculum was that I found that when I started teaching the children, that I'd ask them about, you know, have you heard the story of Noah? And most of them said yes. And so I would say, okay, great. That's wonderful. So tell me what book of the Bible it's in. And they had no clue that it was in Genesis, which is the very first book of the Bible. So um, what I came to understand is that they really needed a foundation of how to look up the stories, where they fall, how the Bible is set up, so that when they're trying to remember the stories and try to relate it to their life, they kind of get that concept, that foundation of where everything is. Now, for $34.99, you get to get this right here. Um, it's a download that you print yourself um, off your home computer um, or your church computer, and you can just put it in a binder like this. And then there's a student workbook that you can also put in either a paper or um, you know vinyl type um, folder, and you can print that as many times as you want for your building. So if you're teaching this for 30 kids, you for that one download, you can print it as many times as you want. We just ask you know that you look at the copyright and you don't share it between churches or districts or for a whole neighborhood or something like that. Okay. Um, now you can also buy off um, a, an alternative site a pre-printed book and, and have it already pre-printed for you if you don't want to print it yourself. So that is an option and we are looking at trying to get the teacher book pre-printed. It's just that when we do that it raises the cost. It's hard to get the teacher book printed for less than $30 when we do it professionally with an outside source versus printing it off of a copy machine at a church or your home. So um, we really believe that learning about God should not be expensive and we try to keep this as low as cost as possible with it only being $34.99 for the downloads for an entire year. Um, so that will be available at some point in an off-site. Um, and I just want to thank you for your time because I know that, you know, you're volunteering to teach your Sunday school or your children or, um, you know, at a church activity and we know how important your time is and this will help you save time by a true five minute prep, you'll find your children engaged, digging in. Um, my children come into the classroom, um, you know, at saying, hey, can I look up the scripture today? Or can I be, you know, able to read one of the scriptures today? And that is such a great feeling to know that the children really enjoy looking at the scripture, finding out where it's going to be, doing the games, the crafts, the activities. They're engaged the entire time. My discipline problems have gone way down and um, it just has made teaching really pleasurable and knowing that it's only a five minute prep and I'm not trying to sit there and cut out little shapes and get all that together every Sunday has been just a wonderful blessing and they they are they are engaged though they still have crafts but they don't have to cut all the stuff out you know a lot of times they're doing um, cards or something like that where they get to draw on their own which I find the children really like better anyways so I just thank you for your time and hope that this is something that you will enjoy. Remember, it's only $34.99 and you can find it at 52BibleLessons.com. Thank you.